Good day kids, welcome to our new lesson in Agriculture 6, Module 9. Lesson 21, Benefits that can be derived from animal or fish raising. This is Teacher Sandy, let's begin. In this video we are going to identify the benefits that can be derived from animal and fish raising and enumerate the different products that can be derived from animals and fish. For our guide question in this lesson, what are the benefits that can be derived from animal or fish raising? We are going to answer this question at the end of the video lesson. Let's proceed. Before we proceed to our topic, let's define some words that you may find difficult to understand. Hoof. Hooves plural noun. The horny part of the foot of an ungulate animal, especially a horse. Hides or skin. A hide or skin is an animal skin treated for human use. Manure. Manure is organic matter that is used as organic fertilizer in agriculture. Most manure consists of animal feces. Byproduct. A byproduct is a secondary product derived from a production process, manufacturing process, or chemical reaction. It is not the primary product or service being produced. Animal or fish raising is one of the sources of livelihood of many Filipino families today. It can be done in one's backyard or in a small lot nearby. And with knowledge, skills and hard work, it can become one of the most profitable businesses today. Raising animals and fish give us a lot of benefits that are important in our family and community. Take a look on the diagram on the benefits that can be derived from animal and fish raising. On the left side you will see the animal products such as, hides and skin, chemical and liquid extraction, animal fat, horns and hooves and manures. On the right side are the fish products such as fish byproduct as human food, fish byproduct as animal feed, industrial uses, fertilizers from seafood byproducts, biochemical and pharmaceutical products. And for the benefits derived from animal and fish raising are the following. 1. Increase production of food. 2. Provide high quality protein. 3. Create employment. 4. Reduce importation of meat and fish and 5. Maintain the meat production. Now, let's remember. Animal and fish raising are both important to us because they give us many benefits such as help to increase production of food, provide high-quality animal protein for human consumption, create employment, reduce the importation of fish and meat and help bring down or maintain the price of meat products. Other animal and fish products are commonly used and consumed in our home as food, medicine, and clothing. Okay, let's have our short quiz. I will give you 5 seconds per item, you can write your answer on your notebook.